Welcome to Connected Media Live at NAB Show. I'm Bridget Nzeku, and joining me is Doug Miller, Head of Global Sales at GigaNet TV. So it's truly an interactive experience versus a one linear channel. And I've got to get out of that channel to now to go check my emails or go to Twitter. You can do that all simultaneously. Welcome to the GigaNet TV platform, a multitasking technology that allows you to create your own digital world on one screen. The login mechanism is an example of the account management or digital rights management integration. This will control the permissions of the content available to the user and or access to the application. This screen is what we call a space. The space contains different size windows where you will be able to load content. Content can include any of the following. Streaming video, live and on demand, streaming audio, web pages, web content such as social media. Spaces are managed by the Space Manager. Here you will see a list of your personalized spaces which may contain any videos you were previously watching. Two examples we've included are sports and news. You can add a space by tapping the plus icon, which will display the various space template designs available. Once you have multiple spaces, you can flip between the spaces in the space manager simply by tapping on them. You can remove any spaces you no longer need. The bottom scroll bar is a live news ticker that can pull from data from various feeds on the internet. Clicking on it will bring up the toolbar menu. The icons represent mute, airplay, pause, resume, all videos, info panel, web panel, video chat panel and space management. Let us load up some content. Click on the content guide icon in any window. Here we have available content shown. To better refine your display of content, you can either use the search bar to type in the name of the program or click on the various filter categories to refine the available content. Clicking a video will bring up information about the program. On the information window, you have the option of clicking on the grey star to make it one of your favourite videos. Clicking the Watch Now button will begin playing the content in the window from which the content guide was pulled up from. Now, click a new window and select a new program. We can now swap or rearrange the two content that we are streaming. We can drag them to other empty content windows. Let's fill up our current space with content. If there is one program that we'd like to have full screen, simply expand the program's window with your fingers. If you'd like to go back to your space of content, pinch the content window to bring you back. You will notice an audio icon that is displayed in one of the windows when there is video loaded. If the audio token has dashes around it, it means audio from all videos are playing with the video that the token is in, being slightly louder than the rest. If the audio token has a solid line around it, only that video's audio can be heard. As he can't fall behind Tap cars. the token to switch audio modes. You can also drag the token between videos that are loaded in your space. Relive those magical three minutes and 42 seconds. Six, four in the fifth. They that. Your cost to capital is important and diversification. Oh, there is! My goodness! Big hit. Victory for Nico Bostock here in Austria. This is the Formula One. You can surf the web alongside your video watching. Click on the web browser icon and the web panel will slide in. Here you can enter your web page URL, speak it, modern family, or select one of the predefined bookmarks. 
Once you have a web page loaded, you can drag the URL bar to either an empty window or replacing another window's content. This allows you to set a placeholder so you can quickly retrieve the web page content. The web panel toolbar has several options which include expanding to full immersive view, back, forward for navigating through your history, and close web browsing panel. The info panel contains web content relevant to the video that you are watching. You may also see icons for related websites which will take you to web pages, official sites, fan sites, etc. that pertain to the video. The shopping panel currently brings you to products on Amazon but can be configured to other shopping sites such as Overstock, Wayfair, etc. The Twitter panel brings up a Twitter feed along with any hashtags which you can drag and drop into a window. The Facebook panel brings up the contents Facebook page. The Instagram panel brings up the contents Instagram page. Other exciting features include AirPlay mirroring and video chat. AirPlay mirroring is designed to allow users to take multimedia content from their device and make it available to multiple sources, including an HD TV set. And the video chat allows users to watch programs with friends from across the globe. Click the video chat icon and select a program for your video chat. A panel will slide out showing friends that are currently watching the same program. Simply invite to allow video chat while you watch your favorite program together. The GigaNet TV icon is for logging out of the app. Look at GigaNet TV's latest features. Visit us at GigaNetTV.com.